the immune system is really important to everyday life, fighting bacteria and viruses every minutes, every seconds. And it's going to be essential in space to be able to fight bugs and bacteria when people are coming in and out of a station. So it's going to be very important to find ways to prevent infectious disease. And the best way to prevent infectious disease is definitely vaccine. So we elected to use a flu vaccine. The way vaccine work is you basically inject a piece of the virus that's harmless or bacteria, and this is recognized by specialized cells that are called T cells that then are going to prepare the immune system to react faster the next time you encounter this particular virus or bacteria. It will completely block you from really developing the disease. So there is two aspects of this investigation. One aspect is just to see if the immune system is going to react the same way in space versus on the ground in a quantitative way. You know, the number of T cells that's going to be recruited. The second aspect is to look at the qualitative effect of this vaccination. Look at the specific T cells that are recruited by the body to fight against the flu only. We are using the latest technology for sequencing these genes in these particular T cells to really identify each T cells in Mark and Scott and try to see how they react to the flu. The importance of this research that we are doing with the twins is really to show how the immune response is different in space versus on Earth, and also to find a way to personalize vaccine, to study the specific immune cells as they react to the vaccine. And one day we hope to be able to do a vaccine that will be specific of each individual, Scott, Mark, and will have less side effects.